So I listened to that Richmond North of Richmond. Apparently somebody put out a rap version of it. So I mean I'm gonna check it out. I mean that was like um uh, ooh, excuse me, backcountry mountain folk type sounds. I even went back and listened to some of Anthony Oliver's um music on Spotify. He actually dropped the Richmond North of Richmond on Spotify and Within the first week, it hit over 11, four, actually, when I looked, it was 14 million plays. So that, so that guy, like, he turned down an $8 million record deal. He probably gonna make that $8 million and run it up real quick. Because when you ain't got, when you got that much attention on you, and you don't have any labels connected to you, guess where all that money going? Straight into here. Straight into here. It's right in his pocket. And he deserves every single penny. But I'm going to check this rap out, this rap version of the song, and I'm going to let y'all know how I feel about it. Let's get it. Well, no, so. I love that song. I've been playing it ever since I heard it. What you do and they don't think you know But I know that you do when I read a good book And it's all coming true When I look to the sky what the world coming to Coming to y'all Demoralization up in the nation Book of revelation what we facing Taxation no representation Slow the spread Increased inflation Slow the spread right. So he's basically on the same wavelength of the meaning of the song He just um He didn't really change the beat much either He just kind of took a small portion of it and repeated it and added some drums around it. But it's still pretty hard. It's not bad. Education. We can't even question misinformation. Propaganda wars, globalization. It's matrix. Communication. The flag indivisible for every individual. Your freedom is pivotal to stay strong. It's critical. They want total control. You can see it's habitual. Elites on our island doing all type of rituals. Release the flight logs, but they won't because they cynical. A thief in the night and you know because it's biblical. Damn, they lying to me. I wonder if this black pal... Pegasus guy is like a oh well, I, I don't know if he's trying to match up with the same subject he was a, Oliver was on or if he's like a Christian rapper maybe I don't know I gotta look more into this stuff to be the best man that I can for my child for my fans united we stand all together on this land see this black and this white and this yellow and this tan and this red and we band all together on this sand politics is a sham they use tragedy to scam bar codes when they scan it's all part of the plan take guns out your hand free speech if you ban lock down to their orders that's the chain of command damn we the people not the did he have two what, what are those things Frenchies two Frenchies Politics is a sham, they use tragedy to scam Barcodes when they scan, it's all part of the plan Take guns out your hand, free speech gives you back I bet you he's a dog breeder Like before, I don't know if he's a full time YouTuber or not But if he's not outside of that, he's probably a dog breeder I got a friend just like that He be selling French, mixed Frenchies for like $10,000 a, a, a pop A pop! Easy six figures. Lock down to their orders, that's the chain of command, damn. We the people, not the government. There's a difference between the lobbies that's running it. This used to be a constitutional republic. I'm having trouble figuring out whether or not the background is like a green screen or something. Because it, he looks, it looks kind of fake. Either that or he just got like a really good quality camera that he's using. I hope you open your eyes before they smother it. They put the all seeing eye up on the mothership to distract you from seeing all the other sh. I'm here to speak the truth. They broke the covenant. I ain't eating insects, my phone they bugging it. Uh, and I believe in freedom. The government is scheming. Censorship for no reason. And I just don't believe them. And I believe in freedom. Corporations they be scheming. Censorship for no reason And I just don't believe them And I believe in freedom Government they be scheming 
I'm not gonna lie, I don't really like the singing. Yeah, Some drums around it, that's pretty dope right there. Shit. And on the rich man. Rich man. Boy, that made me like that song even more. I'm about to go listen to it again. Matter of fact, I might even go surf on YouTube and see if they got a sped up version of it with drums on it, cause that was hard. Shoot, I get back in my car, I'm about to play me some Rich Man North of Rich Men again. But yeah, if I were to rate that rap, though, I'm going to be honest, man. It was probably like a 5.7. It was, I, I got the message, Um, you know, talking about the recession, talking about inflation, talking about God. Talking about, you know, how certain things going on in the U.S. are unfair. Um, I would still say we live in the greatest country in the entire world, though. Just because of all the opportunities that are available here. Of course, that doesn't mean there aren't any other opportunities available in other countries. That will probably be more of a benefit to certain people that feel differently about being in the U.S. But... I guess it depends on what scope you put on you put in front of your eyes because everybody's perspective is different. Because when you chase after something you believe in or have faith in and you don't let anybody talk you out of it, it usually works because that's how that's how faith works, you know? You just got to go for it and put your heart and belief into it and usually it um it works out. Especially when you refuse to um, negotiate your dream. It's a, it's a non-negotiable. Regardless of where you move or where you live. If it's a non-negotiable and you refuse to be moved, mountains can, mountains can be moved. But, um, the rap was dope. But personally, I wasn't really feeling it. I would take what you did to the beat and what you did to the Oliver Anthony part and have that on a playlist and have that on freaking replay because that was hard as hell. But as far as the Black Pegasus rap, it probably wouldn't make my playlist. Just being honest. <clears throat> Excuse me. And if I wasn't honest with my people on... You know, if I wasn't honest with my basement fam, I wouldn't you wouldn't I wouldn't be your friend. I wouldn't be your friend if I didn't tell you the truth. But other people might feel different. Appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if there's anything else you'd like me to check out, put it in the comment section below. Hope you have a good day. Peace.